they're off. Atmosphere didn't begin very well down in three. Chivalry got away well. Royal Standings rider just lost his offside eye and he's trying to tuck back in there. Zululand away with a flyer for Ryan Moore had the lead. Moon over Manhattan quickly gets to second. Two lengths on its time. Royal Standing is now third and fourth on the inside. It's a good strong tempo. Next atmosphere outside Chivalry. So they race together as they go past the 1600. They're ahead then of Go Indigo who's over on the outside. Closely being followed then by uh, Prentice over on the rails and then came San Padre and Coram towards the end and Bondiga was last of all so up the side of the course below the 1400 Zululand the leader from Royal Standing tucked in behind it and Moon over Manhattan's holding third they're a length and a half then on its time over on the outside in fourth spot about a length and a half away came Chivalry getting a pretty nice run on the inside of Atmosphere ditto for the two favourites there Prentice in behind them from Go Indigo about a length away in the field uh, going down the back sand padre from Coram and Bondiga is last they're about to go towards the 800 metres turn and Zululand makes it a pretty strong tempo led by two lengths to moon over Manhattan and Royal Standing third just a bit keen now it's time is fourth two lengths away Chivalry on the inside followed by Atmosphere then Go Indigo Prentice well back with Coram sand padre and Bondiga is last Business end coming up now, and Zululand is the leader, about a neck in front of Moon over Manhattan. On the outside, it's time, Royal Standing ridden along, Atmosphere coming to the outside, Chivalry's coming with him. The two favourites are starting to stake up and make their runs now. To the turn, Zululand about a neck in front of Moon over Manhattan, a length and a half to Chivalry and Atmosphere. They're both hard at it, trying to make ground. Royal Standing staying on, and then go in he go. It's Moon over Manhattan who claims the lead around the home turn, kicked away a length and a half to Atmosphere. Atmosphere. Zulu land. Chivalry can't go on, but it's Moon over Manhattan two in front. Down near the line and Moon over Manhattan is all too good. Won it by two lengths to Atmosphere. Get me to go. I think he'll get up and get third ahead of Chivalry and Royal standing. Zulu land and then Bondigo who's made a lot of late ground from San Padre. A long break in the field. The Corum who's followed further back in the field then by Prentice and it's time last in. It's a win for Mick Price last night. They scored the big one in the Manicato Stakes over the sprint trip, and now they produce Moon over Manhattan. A clever ride by Newark because they were walking up front here. They ran the first 1,200 in 118.82. 2644 over all here, and he just out-toughed them from the right position in the race. Thought the idea was to go back. That didn't work. Froggy summed it up early. Went forward, Moon over Manhattan. And the son of Manhattan Rain, of course, a runner-up in a Cox Plate a few seasons ago, produces Moon over Manhattan to win here. Atmosphere should be up nicely. We'll go to the derby as a maiden, as will uh, Preferment, who's a second favourite at this stage. And it'll be going to go. Off to the Oaks now. A fantastic trial for her running third here. Again, tempo related on speed. From you summed it up here. Yeah, terrific ride, wasn't it? From that awkward gate, got, got in and, uh, yeah, just chased that even tempo. Took over and was pretty strong on the line. Outside of the winner, well, there's pretty much a line of them the next second through to fifth. There wasn't a lot between any of those but when it had a decisive margin go and you go best from the back a nice derby trial from atmosphere chivalry sound again close up fourth uh, your numbers there 4 10 13 and 7 he's great you know what you know what a terrific win for